Hello and welcome to the very first tutorial of the Prolog programming. Here we are with the first definition is that given a relation parent x and y, it means x is a parent of y. And we have to write a program for a given relation that is parent and child and store at least six relations and run following queries. First query is list all the parent child relations, display the name of y's parent, display the name of x child. So basically we know that uh, prolog uh, is uh, something um, that we can derive solutions logically uh, from something that is already given. So prolog program is uh, not a collection of an action uh, like C or C++ but it is a collection of uh, facts together with the rules um, and from which we can derive some conclusion. So uh, prolog is uh, declarative type of language uh, which uses the predicate logic and predicate logic is much similar uh, to natural language uh, what we are using in our day-to-day -day life and uh, now facts and rules and queries so basically uh, any prolog programming or any prolog program is basically based on uh, three things that is first is facts what do you mean by facts now facts is a particular uh, program uh, sorry uh, facts uh, fact is a particular thing that is universally true uh, uh, so uh, all the universal truth or all the truth that is related to particular definition is we can say the facts the second thing is uh, rules now uh, rules is what the rules means uh, what we can derive from the facts right so that all the uh, things that we can derive from the facts will become uh, rules from for that particular program second is a query query is what queries means that we can check something or we can derive something we can inference something uh, from fact and rules that will be a queries so a uh, particular uh, prolog programming is based on a uh, fact rules and queries from where we can derive something right so some conclusions so in this particular uh, program we have to uh, derive uh, we have to uh, find out the relation between parent and child so from very first thing that is uh, fact rules and queries uh, we have to provide some kind of predicates and uh, you know that predicates means uh, natural language and uh, suppose i am writing something in a natural language all that things i can write in prolog programming so first thing for example if I'm talking about the parent of particular child then parent parent in a parent we can say that parent in parent class one member will be a male and one member will be a female so uh, I can write that male is a person because basically all the male and female and parent are part of person class so I can write the thing male then person so here don't write anything in a caps same thing uh, female is again a person so I can write here a female is a person so female person is a symbol right so I can say that what do you mean by male what do you mean by female so basically male is a person female is a person so next parent now parent is a collection of or you can say in a parent one person will be a male and one person will be a female so again parent is what parent is a person so this is writing in a very basic way that is parent is a person don't write in capital right so next suppose now I'm talking about a father so a is a child and B is a parent don't write parent write on father right so a is a child and B is a father now suppose 
I have to write the same thing in a another way, another thing, or another natural language uh, sentence. Then B is a, a father of A. B is again a person, and A is again a person. Right. So the same thing I can write is father person person here a and b is not a symbol but person is a symbol same thing i can write that a is a child and c is a mother same thing same sentence in the natural language i can write that c is a mother of child a. same thing I have to write if in a predicate then same thing is that mother then person why person because I cannot use the symbol a b c in this particular program so I have to write the mother now suppose a is a child and E is an uncle because I have to provide at least the six relations right so here from father from mother to this uncle so A is a child and E is an uncle so I can write the E is an uncle of child A so same thing I can write in a predicate or I can say in a prologue right uncle who is uncle uncle is again a person and child is again a person again next thing uh, if uncle is there then definitely auntie will be there so a is a child and f is aunt the same thing in a predicate logic or in a second sentence i can write f is an Ante. of a so write down ante ante is again a person and the child is again a person don't miss the dot operator dot 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 yeah write down dot everywhere right so second this is a first this is second this is third this is fourth now suppose a is a child and g is a brother of child a same way i can write in a natural language or in a second way that is g is a brother of a right so write down brother simple and here g is a person that is a brother and child that is a is again a person so write down person person so this is it now brother same way I can write for the sister yes A is a child and H is a sister same thing I can write that H is a sister of child sorry child A now same thing I have to write in a predicate that is sister that is person and again 
child is person so here sister is done so here first second third fourth fifth sixth and so many thing you can write so many thing right grandfather and grandmother so many thing you can write here so here is it is with some predicates i can write that this are some predicates but don't write in a exam the predicates right so, so this is the first part and thank you i will be back with the second part thank you